Okay, it's three o'clock. Well, it's three to one. Um, still messing with videos a bit. So, here's the thing. I know there are things in here that are unexplained. Um, all kinds of stuff. So I'm gonna mess around a bit here. Now I, I actually carry this meter here uh, because I like to make sure there's no electricity in certain areas I go actually. Um, so we're gonna turn it on. Okay. Now mind you, one light is normal. All right. Although that little flickeration is not. That's, that was weird. Okay. It's small, but it's weird. Is there something here with me? Just touch this little meter. Oh, I'm holding it, so that could be messed with. But we are going to go somewhere else and, and kind of lay it up somewhere. Um. somewhere where it's not going to fall. Okay, what do I have on that me? Uh, there it is. Nothing on me that would make it go off quite like that. Alright, well... I'm not going to lie, that is weird, very, very weird. We're going to go over here and place this over here. So if something wants to touch this, this is fine. But it's going to be right here. Okay. Um. Now I know how active this meter is around electricity. It will apparently pick up spirits as well okay now while i was holding it and by the way that second green light is due to this uh, like little backdrop here it's plastic so there's a reflection all right see so but i think something i mean i felt a cold chill while i was over there so please uh, come over and touch it over here where i'm not touching it um Okay. Now I've been walking around here all night and hearing something bang on stuff just as I'm walking around in like the store where I was at. Can't explain it. Uh, just like the meter going off a second ago. I, I've been in here for a while, but that's the first time I turned on the meter. Um, I'm doing multiple videos here. Now. There are some backstories with places like this. I'm not going to go into it uh, at the moment. So, but I'm always looking around for noises. There's so many of them in here. And, and that's just a general and that's a normal, I'll be honest. Um, well, places this big makes noises. No question about that. Huh, this is new. They welded these elevator doors shut. Which is probably a good thing. Okay, well, nothing else is touching this meter at the moment. That was me. A bang will do it. You know, so... That was me again. If you squeeze it, it won't do that. But if you hit it, it will. So, like I said, it measures electronic fields, though. So EMF reader. Anyways, I'm not that great with this equipment. But I will say, um, I've used it 
like I said, trying to make sure there's no live wires. Um, I also used it one other time on a spiritual level, which it was just flying off the handle at that time. So I wasn't touching it. That's not what I'm trying to necessarily catch as far as something that extreme going. Let me go over here, maybe. On a solid surface where it doesn't vibrate or anything. Okay, now it's out in the open. Plus, I can see more from this angle. All right. If there's anything here with me, uh, please uh, make that light up for me. Just reach out, reach out and touch it. I got chills. But why is that not lighting up? That was me. So. Huh. There are certain places in here that are highly more active, but to be honest, I'm not going to go there and press my limits because of the type of activity it has been. Um, I do gotta say this as a warning. Um, I work here, so I'm a welcome guest. So, as far as uh, anybody else, obviously, if you're not in play, employed here and you don't have full on consent, and if you do, we'll know about it then you're criminal trespassing. Which in this state is nothing nice. You could even spend time in jail. So, we're always on the guard here because we have been shot at before. So, do we carry weapons over in here? Yes, we do. We protect this place very well. Um, I do, that's, that's important for me to put out there. All right. I'm not even putting in where this is because of that stuff. But, uh, obviously it's, it's a pretty big place. Um, two stories. You can see it goes pretty far down that way. You can't really see how far it goes down that way because I'm at this angle over here. So. It is kind of hot in here. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. So I was hoping something could uh, just reach out and touch my meter. I don't want you to manifest. I don't want you to knock. Just want you to teach, touch that meter. And I've heard you're knocking all night. And you're not allowed to attach yourself to me on any level. You're not allowed to follow me home. That is a must, by the way, when you do things like this. Whether you believe or not, I suggest you say something like that. So if it comes true to you and it follows you, even if you don't believe, that might not stop anything. So, I think I was over here when that happened, wasn't I? I'm trying to keep the flashlight going too here. The right way. Normally that takes a hand in itself, and by the way, just to test it against the phone, you see nothing, right? It's not reading the phone. <clears throat> Is there anything or anyone here with me? Yeah. 
see that at this point. Uh, that one hit was actually pretty interesting because there was no reason for it. Now, this is the first time I've done anything like this in here. Uh, I mean, I just thought it'd be interesting because of the, little vo of the voice of the little girl that I hear on a regular basis in here. Um, I'll put that back up there. Just view again. But yes, there's a, there's a little girl that not only me, but several people have heard uh, that will laugh. And there is a lot of dust in here. I don't know if you can see it on the light at all, but or so I'm kicking some of it up. Um, but one of the reasons I haven't spent a lot of time in here because of how hot it can get. Well, it's still summer. Um, tonight it's actually pretty cool outside, so it's actually pretty nice in here. 